What's going on here? Ethan? Ethan? Wait, am I going to be Lord Ethan? Ethan. I know you control different characters. Yep, I'm, I think I'm going to be Ethan. Okay. I couldn't find him. Could you? I'm the best at hiding. He hides too well. And if he was smart, he would reveal himself. I don't like this game anymore. Maybe something happened to him. Ethan's fine. He's just forgotten <laughs> this, this is a, a game. <laughs> I'm gone forever. Ryan, look who we've found. Don't worry. It's just a game, Ryan. A stupid game. I don't like it. He was worried you were gone. I thought we'd never find you again. I'm right here. And I promise, I'm not going anywhere. Yay. I wish Mira was here. And Asha. And... and Asha. I do too. But Mira's in King's Landing and... Can't she come home? I don't want her to die too. Like Asha Ryan, Greyjoy? She's perfectly safe, I promise you. It's I don't want person. Dad to die either. Maester Ortengrin said he got sent to the wall. I'll miss Garrod. Garrod is smart. Oh, Garrod. Fine. Okay. Garrod is smart. No one will tell me what Garrod did, but it must have been serious. I heard Duncan and Sir Roiland talking. Very they said serious. someone will come here looking for revenge. Everyone's worried about you, but I'm not. I know you'll protect us. Who said they're worried about me? Well, Sir Roiland. Everyone. He says you can't fight very well. <laughs> what? And he calls you a milksop. <laughs> Sir Roiland forgets himself. I don't care what he says. I can protect you. What does milksop mean? I don't know. But I know it's not good. <laughs> Ethan, you should let Sir Roiland teach you how to wield a sword. Like, like a man. He taught Roderick and Asher, and he even showed me how to fight. Properly, I mean. A lord should know how to I don't wanna. Fight. I just wanna fight with two shields. <laughs> one on each arm. Do you remember when we were younger? When we all used to play here? No, I have amnesia. Roderick, Asher. We'd all be out here for hours. Yeah. Where was I? You weren't born yet. We had so much fun. But then, well, then everything changed. Roderick became so serious. A lord in training. He never smiled anymore. And Asha. Asha just got angry at everything. Hmm. Promise me you won't be like that. Please, just be you. I like you the way you are. I don't know who I am yet. I just started I playing the game. Many responsibilities. But you don't need to be I'll like promise. them. I promise sure. I won't change. Good. Because I'd rather have a brother than a lord. You'll have to have both, I'm afraid. But since you're the new lord, you can do anything you want. I suppose. Everyone will have to do as you say. So I could have all the sweets I want. If only it was that simple. It would be nice if someone did what I wanted for once. That's not how it works. Well, that's how it should work. You are the lord. <laughs> See, I'm not gonna let my kid lord Ethan, eat himself into a food coma. And by kid, I mean little brother, not son. This is just so plot heavy, dude. Oh my god. What's the matter? Lord Whitehill has arrived. Oh god. Unannounced and Great. certainly unexpected. He's come demanding justice. <laughs> Could have said off. Can meet with Duncan? He is the Castellan. Stay with us. Please, Ethan. He's demanding an audience with the Lord. We really must go. It's your decision. You are the Lord. If I were Lord, oh God, I would good command Ethan to stay with his family. Fine. If that's what's required of me. Very well then. Why am I going the wrong direction? 
Who the hell is that? I did choose to go with him, right? Okay, yeah. They showed up unannounced. Lord Whitehill is in a lather. I assume you explained the Lord Ethan why they're here. The business with Garrett. Why is he in I the kitchen? Him. Lord Whitehill knows Garrett is a squire to this house. Or was, I suppose. Is. Was. It makes no difference. The Whitehills were clearly in the wrong. So don't give him any satisfaction. Out there, you were decisive and firm. Now do it again with these bastards. Let's not do something rash. Things are bad enough as it is. I got I can this, guys. Lord Whitehill. I well got said, it. My lord. Now is not the time to anger Lord Whitehill any more than he already is. He's got five times as many men and the backing of House Bolton. All the more reason to stand up for ourselves. Only cowards and We're gonna be political about this. Oh god, that guy looks like a douche. Ugh. Lord Ethan, is it? My condolences for your father and brother. The late Lord Forrester was no friend to me or my house. My only regret is I wasn't there to drive the dagger into his heart myself. Oh, I've been dish. waiting for this day all my life. The Foresters finally get their due. Don't I test. may be young, but I'm not so easily fooled. They're trying to rile me, but it won't work. Young? You are that boy. Too young to know when you're in over your head. And no bread and salt! What kind of fucking house receives a lord with no fucking bread and salt? You bloody you, You'll amateur. need more food. No courtesies. I should have expected as much. Bloody foresters. My apologies. Please forgive us. Forgive you? No, uh, I didn't want it to be that. You foresters have I was hoping sarcastic apologies. Well, now the Starks are no longer around to have your back, are they? We're the power in the North now. Roos Bolton is the Warden of the North. Aye. And we've been his bannermen for five fucking centuries. You cunt. Jesus Christ. Lord Ethan, you're losing control of this. We all serve House Bolton now. I'm not finished. Maybe if you hadn't been so fucking greedy with the Ironwood, things would have been different between us. You squandered your share. Our share was taken from us. We had no fucking choice but to harvest what was left. What is it you want, Lord Whitehill? Oh, that guy. Your man, the squire. We were minding our own business. Keeping the king's peace, as his lordship here said, mm -hmm. when your man attacked us for no reason. Hear that? Attack for no reason. No reason? You murdered his family. Then you admit it was your man who killed my men. And a pig farmer at that. How do you answer for your squire, Lord Ethan? He acted in your name. And you are the lord of this house. He was defending his family as any man would. But your men murdered them all. You lost pig farmers, not soldiers. Soldiers were the hunter of their type. Where's the fucking coward who killed my men? I know he's here. What have you done with him? Uh... I haven't seen him. He was never here. You little liar. <laughs> I will find him. By the gods, you better hope I do, because if I don't, I'm holding you responsible. And you'll answer for what he's done. I'm not leaving until I have my justice. Now bring me the coward who did it, or you'll answer to Roos Bolton. What kind of fucking house is this? A house of honorable men. <laughs> Lady Forrester. You bellow like a wounded boar, Lord Whitehill. Have you forgotten your manners? I mean no disrespect to you, my lady, considering your losses and all. But this, this is not over. It's over when my son says it is. I've, I've heard, heard enough, enough, Lord Whitehill. Ethan is Lord of Ironrath now. By rights, his word is law here. If that displeases you, then I trust you can find the door. 
Hey, mom came to the rescue. Not allowed. Maybe lord of this house. But lord Bolton will have the final say. I'll send him a raven letting him know a forester man killed one of his own. That the new Lord Forester lied to my face and denied me my justice. Then we'll see whose word is law. Mm, do as you, like. you like, Lord Whitehill. <laughs> well, that didn't go very well. I was wrong about your son, my lady. He stood up to him like a true lord. You were brave, my son. Yay, you maybe I did do well. Still when Ramsay still <laughs> arrives to see you bend the knee. Do? Prepare a raven. We need to send oh word god, to that guy. Landing at once. The dude that likes torturing people? Ah, oh, shit. I think that's the guy, because he's a bastard. Oh, man. Friggin' intense. Your sister can help us. Although just a handmaiden, she has Marjorie Tyrell's favor. Myra Forrester. And maybe Marjorie's betrothal to the king may be enough to keep the Boltons at bay. Marjorie? It's presented to her as it should be. Alright, so now we're doing a whole nother person here. So, uh, ooh. That looks delicious. That also looks delicious. Oh my god, there's so much fruit in here. I'm never getting scurvy. Well, anyway, that's enough of uh, recording this for, you know, today. So, you know, I've been BK. This has been a few episodes of uh, Game of Thrones. You know, thanks for watching, man.